Breaking news. Scientists have discovered a third way to inherit traits, because DNA and RNA were apparently feeling lonely. Turns out, proteins called amyloids are stepping up to the plate. Who knew inheritance could be so, sticky? So, let me get this straight. For centuries, we've been told that DNA and RNA are the Beyonce and Jay-Z of inheritance. But now, proteins, yes, the same ones linked to Alzheimer's, are crashing the party. Amyloids, you sneaky little blobs, welcome to the family drama. Imagine being a worm in a lab, minding your own business, and suddenly you're the poster child for groundbreaking science. These worms became less fertile and more feminine over generations, thanks to amyloids. Talk about a glow up, or maybe a glow down. Scientists even found glowing green dots in the worms, cells and named them, parasomes. Because nothing says cutting-edge science like naming things after Greek mythology. Parasomes, the new Kardashians of inheritance. But wait, there's more. These amyloids can replicate themselves, making them inheritance vectors. So, next time you blame your parents for your quirks, don't forget to thank your proteins too. They're working overtime to keep the family resemblance alive. In the end, inheritance is officially more complicated than your ex's excuses. DNA, RNA, and now amyloids, because why settle for two pathways when you can have three? Science, you've outdone yourself.